I think this would be a great tunnel fit. You know, I thought it just looked really slick, really clean, and then I'd feel juicy in it, so hopefully I'd play juicy in it. Hey guys, it's Mitch Marner here, here at Holt Renfrew for What Do You Wear? All right, I'm here to build my outfit. We got a season, a reason, a wild card. Let's see what we get here. All right, we got winter as our season. We got a lot of different kind of elements coming at you with snow, rain, wind, so you know, gotta be ready in that way. Let's go reason here. Let's go top. Road trip, team dinner. We got a lot of team dinners on our team. Try to hit the dinner all together once or twice a month. Wild card, let's uh, travel essentials. iPad, gotta have my toiletry kit. I like bring a nice comfort wear for after dinner stuff. And then always a nice pair of jeans, pair of shoes and a hoodie. Let's go downstairs, let's pick some outfits up. All right, well we got the scenario now. So it's time to uh, browse the shelves here. Let's pick some outfits out. I like trying to build from the bottom up, depending on my shoes, what I bring, I try to color coordinate. I like to try and bring my top hats. That's something that I've really tried to build in my outfits this past year, is kind of bring a new little style. I think I'm just kind of just seeing what I'm feeling, see what I like. I'm a big comfort guy, so I'm kind of seeing what I think is gonna be the most comfort. That's how I like to do it. The city can definitely change the vibe for sure. When we go somewhere warm, I say the boys try and pull a little bit more of a nicer outfit on. I think our team is you know, pretty crazy with our fashion. I think the boys aren't afraid to wear some crazy stuff and we all respect it. And I think Austin's got some great style. Willie's got great style too. Probably those two are the top two on our team. <laughs> the league's gotten a lot better with giving us our own fashion. It's been great to see. I mean, it, guys can really bring out their personality more. I keep my travel kit in my bag at all times so I know I never forget it. I like hairspray in there, hair gel, toothpaste, toothbrush, comb, and then under arm deodorant. So it's pretty simple. I'm good. I got a lot of stuff to try out here. Yeah, this is this is a fit that I would wear a lot of times, especially wintertime team dinners. You know, just a classic boot, the black jeans, the hoodie with the bomber jacket over top. You, know, you can wear in the elements for the wintertime. So this is a fit I can definitely wear a lot of times. The shoes are Christian Louis Vuitton. The jeans are Xenia. The hoodie is Orlebar Brown. The bomber jacket is Tom Brown. Yeah, my fiance would definitely like this outfit a lot. It's a clean look. We're pretty busy being on the road, so she goes and picks out a couple things that I'll like, and kind of that's how we make the outfits. It's usually a collab. I think LA or, or New York, the best style. I said you get a lot of celebrities at both those games, and usually they're pretty dressed up, so. We're giving a lot of love here to New York. Italian restaurants, steak restaurants, a variety of food you can get. It's always top notch there. Favorite restaurant here in Toronto, I gotta go Soto Soto. It's just been my favorite since I've gotten here. I'm a big Italian guy. I think a lot of hockey players will probably tell you the same. Pasta, carbs, especially nights before games. Depending on how long I'm gone on a road trip or something like that, these boots do great for, you know, just the fashion of going out for dinner. I can also pull off a nice look with a suit. You know, the jeans, just a nice classic black jean. Hoodie's always kind of just my thing that I like for comfort, and bomber jacket just adds a little more style. It's just clean, I would say. All right, so we just did the scenario of a team dinner fit. Pick a new scenario, let's pick a new fit. Let's go season. Let's go down here. All right, spring. Spring in Toronto, it's getting cold, so it's making sure you got the layers for dinner. Let's go, let's go bottom again. Off day date night. Oh baby, it's nice to get a date night. You know, kind of just enjoy each other's presence. A couple cocktails, I guess. Let's go. Watches really complement a whole outfit. Can bring everything together, just make it look really slick, especially for a date night. And uh, saying that, let's go pick a fit. It's date night, let's pick an outfit out here. Usually I'm getting it regardless of the designer name. Depends if it catches my eye or not. Wearing whatever outfit you want and just kind of owning it and just embracing it and letting it fly. I don't think my style changed at all living downtown. You know, when I can get out of a suit, I'm quickly out of it and I'm wearing something else. So depending on the nights, I still like going comfort most of the time. I like the bomber jacket. I think a nice white tee under this would look great. Kind of decide if I want these light pair of jeans. I'm gonna take that because I think it could look good. I like wearing just a nice collared shirt sometimes just for date night and matching the shoes up with that. You have to pick up the bill on the first date for sure, always. 
I like to put a nice watch on for date night usually. It kind of brings the whole fit together. I mean, these two catch my eye right away. And this black and blue piece right here just, I feel like really calls my name and that would be the one I would pick. But I think I'm ready to go over. All right, so let's see what we got. The shoes are Amiri. The jeans are Rag & Bone. The tee is Sunspell. The jacket is Giovanni. The watch is Label Noir Rolex. I think it just looks really slick, really clean. Best date night spot in Toronto. Can never go wrong, I don't think, with any spots in Toronto. It's always buzzing. Just trying to find a cocktail bar that uh, is unique and cool to the city. That's something that we always try to find. I don't know, man. I think, you know, obviously the NBA's got a lot of personalities, a lot of style. You can't go wrong with a lot of those guys. Shy and, and OKC is obviously a guy that wears some pretty crazy outfits, but flaunts them really well. I think this would be a great tunnel fit. You know, I thought it just looked really slick, really clean, and, and I'd feel juicy in it, so hopefully I'd play juicy in it. All right, no scenario this time, so I'm just gonna browse the shelves, pick something out for an off day or a practice day. Let's go. Yeah, I'm lazy with my practice days outfits. I can put a nice pair of shoes on. I mean, I'm a big, big sneaker head. G pair of sweats and a nice hoodie. That's kind of my go-to. Clean, easy to go with, all comfy. All right, everyone, came through Holt Run Through, tried on some juicy fits for you. What do you wear? Season two, episode two. It's the chicken wrap, no tomato. Hope you guys enjoy it.